Hi everyone, so we're back with another episode of The Women Gliding and today we're talking with April Banbury who is also Miss Great Britain and she has an amazing passion and affinity for flying and I want to talk to her today about what her experience has been in power flying as well as her first glider flight that she had last year at Husband's Bosworth. <laughs> so April, hello and welcome and tell us a little bit about you. Hi. Well, thanks for having me firstly, hello. Um, well, basically, obviously my background, um, I won Ms. Great Breton pretty much a year ago, two days ago. Um, my career is in bridal design, so it's completely the opposite to anything flying, or like, you know, aviation related. Um, but our, my first flight um, was actually for charity, and that's where I sort of guess I caught a little bit of a bug for it, you know? it was we were running uh, raising money for cancer research and Alex's wish and part of it was to do the loop the loop challenge and I have such a fear of heights so obviously I was super excited to, to obviously take part in it and be able to raise raise the funds and the awareness for the charities but because I had such a fear of like heights mixed with a combination of a bit of an adrenaline junkie I sort of couldn't wait to do it in a way yeah. and I remember getting up there and just being so terrified when I like looked out of the plane and realized how high up I was but there was a moment that almost came over me and I just had to talk myself out of panic mode because I, I was literally thought to myself if I freak out now that's it game over I'm not going to do the loops you know I would have failed this charity challenge and I couldn't I couldn't possibly do that so once I actually went through there and did it it was an like the most incredible feeling like and I literally caught like I said a bug and a, a passion for wanting more of it I guess you might say yeah I know absolutely and the um so Rob was flying with you with Aerosparks which is also yes husband's Bosworth yeah and then from there um he I think invited you to have your first gliding flight he did, yes. Yeah. So obviously, once I obviously took part in the charity challenge, he was looking for an ambassador, and I was obviously selected to become the ambassador of Aerosparks. With that, I was like, Rob, right? I want to learn to fly. Let's do this. <laughs> so I don't think he quite expected that much. <laughs> so he obviously took me up in one of the grogs, and I absolutely loved it. I got a bit travel sick whilst I was up there after about half an hour. But I think I'm over that now. <laughs> but yeah. yeah, like I said, I just got such a good feeling and a buzz for it. It's kind of like an addiction. I mean, you must, you know, know that as well, doing it yourself. But yeah, I, I guess I just became addicted and just wanted more and more. And I feel like I'm always pastoring here. I'm like, can we go up again? Can we go flying again? <laughs> when's the next time <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah and it's interesting you mention about having that fear of heights and mm -hmm. you know I think sometimes when you go up in a plane it's not exactly how you imagine it would be in terms of that yeah. fear of maybe looking over a building yeah it's not the same it's really not the same uh, I mean like I said when I first went up I thought if I look out the window I'm gonna you know all those fear of heights that fear of heights is gonna take over and I'll you know I won't want to do it but it didn't happen I sort of was just I was just enjoying the moment and the scenery like a different perspective on the world like being up in the sky it was just an incredible feeling and you just I just didn't think about the fear of heights. I mean, here I am wanting to actually learn to fly and I still can't, you know, climb up a ladder. <laughs> <laughs> and I think neither. So <laughs> flying is just such an incredible, completely different experience, I think. Absolutely. And what was your, like when you first went in a glider, because it's quite different again from power flying, mm -hmm. what was your experience with gliding? I absolutely loved gliding. I think because it was so peaceful and tranquil, there's no like engine sound. It's just so soft and like elegant, you know, in terms of flying, I guess. Um, yeah, just uh, the experience is just incredible. And you know, the things that you can see from up above that you never would be able to anywhere else at any other point, you know, on the earth sort of thing. So it was really, yeah, it, it really like, I sort of felt at one with myself and nothing else in the world or in my life kind of mattered but you know when I was in that moment just concentrating on taking in everything that was around me it was yeah super peaceful it was amazing yeah and you mentioned to me before that you wanted to learn potentially and go solo one day I, I do I do yeah and I think that's, that's an incredible goal and to have that 
you know it's kind of like learning to drive initially it's all those feelings yeah and, and emotions and then when you're first let out loose to begin with you're like oh, yeah that's really new <laughs> And I think gliding is quite similar when you've gone solo and you, you know, you look behind you and you think, oh, that, I'm on my own. There's nobody uh, else there. <laughs> I, I can't, I can't wait for that moment. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> yeah. And I, I look forward to seeing you maybe at Husband's Bosworth and yeah, yeah. to help you and guide you through the journey of learning to fly and going solo. Yeah. That'd be amazing. Thank you so Thank much. You You'll get tickles in my face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always, honestly, I'm always pestering Rob asking to yeah. come up. <laughs> well, you'll probably be pestering me now, but that's fine. I will, I will. <laughs> <laughs> we'll try and set something up for sure. And amazing. Yeah, I'd love it. We do that. Love it. Yeah, we can bring bring another video forwards about eight course yeah. journey to learning how to fly. Yeah, stay tuned. <laughs> Thank you. What's next? <laughs> So thank you so much, April, for coming on and just having thank a you. chat and talking to everyone about your first gliding experience and what that was like for you. And thank you for watching everyone and I'm gonna see you in the next video. Bye now. Bye.